It's hard to just pick on one thing, but if I were, I would say the excellence in robotic surgery. Um, there are excellent people in robotic surgery and other departments, but the uniform excellence that we had here with uh, Dr. Tuari, Vidani, Vivian, Starkianos, and all the other folks, yeah. it was unparalleled. Um, I speak as someone who knows a little bit about robotic surgery. I had never seen Baha Sachin and said, well, I'm not for a tough catalyst. But if I only go a little bit more than that, I want to say there is excellence in the non robotic area, which too. There's excellence in pediatrics, there's excellence in pediatrics and the urology, there's excellence in reconstructive look, urology, being the intercepts. Uh, and still into sense. Oh man, it's so uh, truly mind boggling um, that to, no matter what your logical problem you have, some of the leaders in the world uh, are here, but with a bad downside. That. It's hard for me to say one string because it is so strong and everything, but again, um, if, if I were to pick one, I would say head and shoulders uh, out of the excellent and minimal invasive surgery. I think the Mount Sinai Department of Urology is a comprehensive urology department really tackling all facets of urology care uh, with leading experts in each one of the specialties <clears throat> that allows us to give the best care to our patients. Um, you know, my focus and, and one of the strengths of our oncology program has been this multidisciplinary approach to uh, taking care of patients with bladder cancer and testicular cancer. It has allowed us to build a strong team uh, in, in being able to manage all sort of types of uh, cancer, bladder cancer specifically, or testicular cancer that we're dealing with. Uh, this multidisciplinary team is filled with clinicians, nurses, physical therapists, nutritionists, and scientists. I think at this point in time, we have now completed over 400 uh, robotic intracorporeal uh, radical cystectomies, and our outcomes continue to improve, showing how much energy and effort we're putting into our patients. at Mount Sinai um, is a multidisciplinary science and clinical approach uh, to all the problems to impact patients' lives. Um, it is a, really a great platform uh, for clinicians, surgeons and scientists to come together to address important problems uh, and the utilization of great resources available at our institution uh, that support uh, the performance of academic excellence and the opportunity to train uh, the great, uh, the young, talented investigators. the Department of Urology apart uh, from other institutions it's its commitment to bringing awareness to prostate cancer. It's done an amazing job at launching our prostate cancer screening mobile unit. Luckily with an amazing donation from Robert Ed Smith we were able to put this unit out in the community. We had an amazing go live uh, on April 1st 2022 where we had Al Roker debut our mobile unit on the Today Show. We've also had uh, amazing events throughout the community 
We participated in the African Day Parade as well. We've screened almost 2,000 patients and we've done over 150 events so far. We've noticed that there is at least 20% of the men that we screen require further follow-up. Their PSAs are elevated uh, above 5.0, and we bring them back into the uh, practices for their follow-up care with Dr. Tawari and our other providers. Many have led to actual needed surgeries. The unit has had such an amazing impact in the community that is extremely sought after. So far, we've already started to fill in our schedule for 2023 spring and summer. Lots of the churches and the community uh, locations that uh, were able to host us last year have already started to seek us out. We've done fun things, we've done fashion shows, parades, and we're extremely, extremely uh, grateful for the donation that Robert Smith has done and all of Dr. Tawari's work uh, and clinical care that he's put in uh, towards this program. If you ask any department in the country what the triple threat is, um, it's being able to both operate on patients and take care of patients clinically, spend time in the lab helping to bring discoveries and innovations from the, the lab bench to the bedside, uh, and of course having a support team that's there to make all these processes possible. And I think Mount Sinai Urology has all three of those. Um, having leaders in all the urologic subspecialties along with an army of basic scientists and researchers who are working not only to um, figure out how we surgically treat disease, but how do we diagnose disease more efficiently.